All right, welcome to Inquilinati. <laughs> Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. I'm honestly not too sure. I don't really know much about this game. I mean, right off the bat when I saw it, the art style just amazing. Okay, it was just eye-catching instantly and I knew I had to play it. And then I read this uh, the Steam description and yeah, it, it, it still didn't really make sense. So I was just like, you know what? I'll figure it out as I go along. So I'm about to do the the intro right now teaching me how to play the game so this can either be a one episode or a full series i don't even know if it's a series it kind of just seems like it was it's like a roguelike almost so i guess we're gonna see what's gonna happen all right i think we've started now uh, i think the training's over so <laughs> hopefully i can put what i learned into action Two masters of the living ink in Kulinati with duel on the margin of an ax of an ancient manuscript. I, I read that as accident and it messed up my whole thought process. This is your entry exam. You'll be playing as Godfrey in a duel against Hildegard, the Holy Church reformer. Ooh. In order to win an Inkulinati duel, you must destroy your opponent's tiny Inkulinati. Do so either reduces health or push it into the abyss or the fire of the apocalypse. Sword attacks deal the most damage, although they can only target adjacent fields. Spear attack excuse me, spear attacks can reach up to two fields away or one level away. Or attacks can hit up to six fields away except adjacent ones. Beasts that only um, that use bows have the lowest amount of health. However, Oh, <laughs> however, was have the lowest amount of health. However, <laughs> I said that like you're about to continue. Mm, okay. I mean, right off the bat, can I just? Ah, uh, it's just too far away. I think. Yeah, I don't want to risk that. So let me just push myself this way a little bit. And then we're going to get a bow. I, I feel like, I don't know where she's going to put her, like, if I choose this, where can I put it? Right there. I do feel like putting, like, a, yeah, sword right here in case they get close. And I don't, I think, oh, I can deploy another unit. Uh, I can deploy a bow guy. If I put a bow guy right here. I love the fact that you can just push them into the abyss. Because then now I have to be careful about if I like what unit I put in this place. Otherwise, they're basically just a free kill. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to end my turn. Hilda guard? Okay. Hilda guard's a little bit of a... I'm guessing the push uh, action is probably going to have, like, a turn limit. Like, I can't just use it whenever I want. Collecting ink. To draw beasts, you need ink. You can replenish your ink by ending your turn on ink blots. You will receive three chapter of ink for your tiny, and each ally be standing on the field, but only when the chapter ends. Yes, I see where that is. You can see how much living ink uh, currently has. Keep an eye on it. If you want to learn more about specific gameplay elements, please refer to the instructions. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I mean, I can... I can... Tell him to infiltrate their ranks right now. Hold on, what if... Where is the Inquilinati? Uh... I think... Yeah, the issue is, if I select one unit so whatever unit if, for example if i start an action with the inquilinati i can't perform an action with any other unit that's the only person i can perform an action if i start, start an action with the sword wielding dog i can't perform an action with anything else so even though i can use the inquilinati to push this little annoying ass in the back out of here probably isn't smart to do that right actually can i Uh, 
down. I can't. No. <laughs> I'm stupid. That's not what I meant to do. I was going to check what I can do with it. Ah, okay. There are three types of ink blood. Small, medium, and large. You can collect three drops of ink from each. One at a time. The ink blood side determines how many times you collect ink from it. Uh, okay. Uh, small ink bloods you can use only once, but you can finish a chapter on the large one three times before they disappear. Okay. So if I stand on this ink blood, I can use it to perform actions. But it's still not enough because I need six to be able to do what I need. Okay, that's fine. It's annoying ass. The long range is annoying. He's going to hit me. Okay. That's fine. Can you run over here real quick? Oh. Okay, you know what? Yeah, no. Run over here. Attack. Both adjacent fields at once can be used every two chapters deals five to seven damage so if i'm basically surrounded by enemies on both sides which i am not there's a target one level of halo that makes them temporarily unpushable i can do that okay so we're gonna go like this real quick but no. Got it. Just out of here. Ooh, one HP left. Oh, this annoying ass. Oh, you made a mistake, sir. I can kill. I guess they want me to go through all the units to see what they can do. Cause. Uh, can you come over here? Can you not? Okay. Hell of arrows. Three, three target. Up to. Uh, can I? Uh, let me try this. <laughs> this might be a bad idea. Special area attack allows you to target more than one unit at a time. Be careful if one of your allies come within range. That's exactly what I thought was going to happen. Because I'm like, I feel like this is... Okay, no, that's stupid. No, 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 no. Because <laughs> that's going to kill him. But the thing is, next turn, she's going to... You know what? It's fine. Because next... When it's her turn, she's just going to kill him anyway. He's got three HP. So, you know, might as well kamikaze a little bit oh so you have to time it for each one if you if you have up to three targets you like there's like a randomizer for all three of them yo that's ridiculous this game is fun so far i like it uh use tooltip mode the icon at the top of the screen switches tooltip mode on and off if you want to know if your opponent's beast is able to attack you check its movement range Going to do this while playing on the controller, you must enable tooltip mode. Okay. In a given turn, you can only move one unit, either a beast, beast or a tiny. If you decide which one to move, you can switch between active, non napping. Oh, non napping. I was like, non napping? Non napping units with a dedicated button. Yo, everyone is dead. Can I go back to my ink Illuminati real quick? I need ink for more units, but I feel like how many dam how much damage? Two to four? It's gonna take a while. But I can't even you know what no no. Because the goal isn't to kill it's to kill their ink Illuminati, so I need to start making progress towards that. So let me get some more ink, and that guy's dead. Oh, full HP. I still don't have enough. 
quick kill. Uh, huh. Go back. I think I should have. I should have attacked. Five, but he's still gonna be able to get a turn. She's got eight, so she can summon some apocalyptic fire. Oh, oh. Oh snap, okay, well that's not fair. I didn't know that was coming because that guy is dead if she pushes him. It's the beginning of the end of the battle. At first you'll see the field that's going to be affected by the apocalypse. In the next chapter, everything including your tiny inclinati that remains in this field will be destroyed. The tiny inclinati ends up in a field of um, push them off. Of it to save them, remember you can also use beasts to push your tiny. Uh, kill the enemy. Tiny Kunai with attacks, push them off the battlefield, or let the apocalypse get them. Yo, there's a lot to this, man. There's a. Why would I willingly just run into the fire? Okay, I can do this. I don't have enough for that. Okay, uh, do this instead. Attack this guy. Kill him. Yeah, he's gonna be able to get an attacker. <laughs> yeah, I am not playing this well at all. Just poke him. It's fine. It's fine. I should have done that. Oh, I'm stupid. I should have done that before. That would have been an instant KO because it deals five damage guaranteed. And then I can't summon a unit so I can. Get some yo, I'm suffering for ink. I need to get a unit on this ink blot right. Here. She's got two ink blots on her side. That's why I'm losing. Hold on. Yeah, she is balling right now with ink. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Right. You are gonna move here and attack these guys there we go and then that gets me extra ink for some unit i get the frick off of that yes he is so rich how how am i losing in the tutorial <laughs> okay hold on okay i can get a dog Can I push? Why can't I push her? Am I too far away or something? I could push him off of that. You know what? Do it. Oh, I can only push like three squares. Okay, I got it. Nah, end my turn. I need the egg. I am so frick. I need to move. Ah, oh, no, I'm good. I'm safe for it. Oh my god. What? I was gonna say, why does she get all the long range enemies? But I got long range enemies too, to be fair. Why am I not using them? I don't know. Hold on. I'm thinking, right, I'm, I was trying to, okay, I'm thinking, move into this area, do this attack, but, kill both of those, so she can't get her, okay, well, she can get her ink now, but, yo, she Kicking the mess out of me right now. Okay, I'm gonna need you to. Oh, I can move myself onto the ink. 
Okay. Now we're talking. And then... Guaranteed five? Poke this guy. Jazz out of here. And my turn. Okay, I'm, I have a... Okay, I have... Okay, I kind of see how the game is supposed to kind of work now. So even though I might lose during the tutorial, and she has way less HP than me, by the way. We're not going to talk about that. <laughs> she has 14 HP and I have 35. Yo, how much more handicap can it give me? Okay, well... Can I get... I can't get a unit yet. So if I just use you to attack... Kill this guy. Oh, okay, so you can just... See, I... And I'm dead. What? How much damage does the spear guy do? No, start that again. Shut up. Shut up. No, I don't care. Shut up. Yo, first of all, how much damage does the spear guy do? Three to five. My health was not that... Oh, he pushed me into the... Okay. Okay. I see. So here's the thing, right? <laughs> Can I not just deploy a unit and just have it run all the way over to her and just push her into the thing? Maybe. Maybe. Let's try that. I think it would have to be the sword, right? Because... No. Okay, well. Maybe next time. Oh, and I can get another one. Over... Here. Okay, so is she gonna do lit oh she's literally gonna do the exact same thing she did in the last turn. Okay. That's cool. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 that's fine. Shut up. Alright, you run all the way over here. This is not a good idea with this unit I have. Run here. Get this ink block. Which is cool. And you can do this AOE right here. Yup, 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 yup. Jazz out of here. Okay. Mup. Yo, my beast should be able to tank attacks for me. Like, look, he's the same height as me. How is that attack still hitting me and him? It's me and you. Okay. Uh, I want a... How much? Two to four? Well, that's not really going to do much. But I do feel like if I move you forward just a little bit more. Ooh. Can you move again? Right? Oh, you're going to go to sleep if you do that. Okay, that's fine. So you said six, right? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, well, can I just do this then? To execute a more powerful attack on his next move, I'm pushable into. Okay, well, that's not what I meant to do, but okay. Uh, yeah, let's just go to sleep. 
I've got I've, I drew first blood okay I got the first damage on the painter so that's fine yeah I am not good at this game <laughs> okay I can use this guy who's been sleeping to attack these two right here I messed that up a little bit, but that's fine. Minus one, what? Oh, okay, I was like, why did I take damage? Okay. I think I should start, I can deploy units now, but I should start building up my ink so I can deploy a little bit more unit once the apocalypse start coming in. So right now I should be focusing on just kind of pushing up a little bit, a little bit more and doing damage with the long range so that's what i want it's asleep lazy ass i don't want to get off this because of the ink block it's giving me extra ink can i get them from here i can oh beautiful get her six hp okay Okay, this guy might die. Oh, you are terrible. Okay, that's good for me. Now it's my Inculinati's turn. I can get a sword wielding unit. Or I can go to sleep and get more ink. Five. Eight. Okay, I, I'm gonna go to sleep, get more ink. No. Actually, yeah, no. Yes? No? Yes. I'm gonna summon this guy. Right here. He's gonna go to sleep. Which is fine. Can I don't push? I can. I'm gonna then push him past enemy lines. Not really past enemy lines. He's still gonna be able to attack. Go to sleep. Like, I'm trying to get this guy to her. I'm trying to push her into that fire. It's the beginning of the end of battle. That was the first you see the field. Blah, blah. Yes, yes, yes. Shut up. Shut up. Like, if I get this guy to move, where can he? He can move here comfortably. So, I can't believe you can just do that. <laughs> okay, so now she kind of wasted her moves doing that. And she can't control any other units, which is good. I mean, none of the. Can you reach that? Okay, you guys can gonna damage. Can do this. Oh. oh, you are cooked. Okay, I just need to be careful that one of these annoying ass units don't just push me into this fire. Okay, so y'all are gonna die. But that's okay. Because the ink blot is gone, so what I'm gonna do. Let's take this guy, move him forward. And go to sleep. Go to sleep. Okay, this is gonna hurt. A little bit rude, but that's fine. Alright, you know what? This guy's awake now, so you are dead. I can just end the game like this. This is not. This is not fair. That's messed up. <laughs> I think that's what she did to me. I should have said not coming. You should. You should have. Okay. What could she? Okay. What would you would she have done there? 
I think she could have pushed herself past me to go here. I think she really, as soon as I got close, she really should have focused on killing the dog, I think. Maybe. Alright, uh, there is literally like two more courses, like beginners and intermediate, but I'm, I'm, I'm not doing it. I'm gonna, we're gonna go on a journey, alright, we're gonna, we're gonna learn on the way now. We've learned the basics. <laughs> How would I rate my skills? I don't know if this is permanent because I just for the bands, I, just for the jokes, I wanted to go right here just to see how hard the enemy would be. But if it's permanent, I'm cooked. So we're going to go normal. We're going to go normal. Uni. Okay, so we got a couple of options. Uh, let me so you got Cooney, you got damsel <laughs> that's unfair to her andreas miller and alwife is that what how you pronounce that alewife alwife aliwife <laughs> i don't know and then you got different beasts that you can go to you got like the prayers and headaches is what they're called. <laughs> Box of War. Secular Cullen. Mm. And then obviously you got other ones, but you need to get prestige to be able to get those. This one has the SWAT. I think this one was the one that I was using in the tutorial this one has living ink so this gives me extra ink which is nice secular cunning i like it. i'm gonna go with prayers and headaches because i will and then i think you can change like the individual oh no just Okay, so you can sub out people. Okay. You really can build. You, like, you're building a deck is really how this is looking to me. You know, like, you're building this like you're building a deck. Attacking adjacent fields, giving the target. I'm literally, at any moment, I'm just expecting just a random in the distance. Someone should just shout, Yu-Gi-Oh! Just at any moment right now. Attack the adjacent field, giving the target beast a headache, can also cause headaches. Uh, these are these are the mon I'm trying to get it right in my head. These are the monster cards. These are the effect um, effect cards, I think. And talents would be like what the trap cards. And then obviously you can build have like different monsters and different you know support cards and stuff. I forget what the support cards are called. Mighty hair, attack suggestion field giving target a beast. Eh? And I think this is a healing. I really want to go with the mighty hair, but it costs 15 ink to summon him. I didn't even get close to double digit ink in the in the tutorial, apart from the beginning. 15? That's wild. Okay. I think we're gonna go with we're not going with we're not going with Ali Wife. I like Damsel. We're gonna go with Damsel. Because hopefully when we lose <laughs> we can still pray for someone to come say this. Oh you can change the names. Okay no, I'm, I like Damsel. I'm gonna keep it. Or put no nah, I don't want to change it next what is this is this where I select my hand actions modify okay
Oh, so I'm only allowed up to five hand actions, but I can hold up to like nine. So I can select which ones I want to take with me. Okay. Okay. Damsel, I choose you. Today you'll pass your final exam, become an inclinati master, and stuff, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> what do I do again? Wild Beast encounter Icon, Tiny Inclinati versus Wild Beast. Encounters are marked with a sword and kill an icon. The enemy Tiny Inclinati is not present in this type of battle. In terms of location, you cannot leave it, so choose carefully. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I mean, there's not really. <laughs> you make it sound like they, I, there's pre planned freaking paths for me. You make it sound like it's an open world or something. Change my army. In what way? Oh, I can I, I can literally just choose not to <laughs> not to take him with me. Do I get anything for like not choosing to take him with me? Because it doesn't seem like I do. Apocalypse type. Apocalypse in chapter four. Uh, what is this? Glade event. Random objects of this type would appear on the battlefield every two to three chapters. And interest a couple of ink blasts are spawn every one to two chapters. Oh my god, look at the units he had. Okay, hold on. Because my hair is like one HP. Why does their unit have one more HP than mine for every like classification the spear guy has 10 i got nine the bow guy got nine i got eight okay so i hold on actually i changed my army why can't i bring that other beast with me because is the okay you know what it's fine it's fine i don't know what i'm doing we're just gonna play chapter one yeah, 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 shut up. I already did the tutorial. This is why you don't do tutorials. Alright. Yo, what? Oh, okay. These are... Okay. I thought I was... I was so confused. I thought I was going to be fighting another Inquilinati. I'm, I'm raiding their camp, basically. Okay, that makes sense now. I got it. I'm gonna put you right here for that. And then we're gonna do and one turn for the Inquilinati and then okay, you can just run up apparently. Oh, and that's gone. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. Yo, I got 22 ink blasts. That's actually nice. Yeah, 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 shut up. Yeah, I really didn't need to do the tutorial if it was gonna, just gonna tell me what the frick to do. Uh, sword wield and rabbit. Bishop cat. 1 to 5 damage. 15 HP. What's, what does the bishop cat do actually? Because I kind of just chose him because it was it cost less, but now I kind of wish I chose the other guy. Okay, and uh, hey, yeah, 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 shut up. Okay, I can push this guy one step away. Uh, I can't, it's too far. He's just out of reach, which is unfortunate. Can I push? No, right push this and then go to sleep. What, he can just run past that? What? Excuse me? Here comes the butt. 
causes an enemy beast to take a nap, get a headache, and lose accuracy. The action won't work if the target is facing your beast. Oh. Do I want to do this? Sure. Let's try it. <laughs> oh, and I get my accuracy up. Okay. Can I attack? I don't know if I attack him. Does that take the effects off? It does not. Okay. I'm pushable and my damage is up. My accuracy is up. Everything's up. I am rolling in ink. Excellent. Even though this guy is still like somehow in a... T oh, frick. I'm stupid. I'm an idiot. I just realized if I kept that barrel there, then he wouldn't have been able to get close. Okay, I messed myself up. Bro, shut up. You, I've done this already. Get the frick out of here. Hmm. Okay, hold on. Push this guy out of here. I need you to not be here, please. And then push this back. Oh, it's out of range. All right, healing for no one's even taking for myself actually. Heal myself. <laughs> and end my turn. Break out of here. <laughs> this guy is still just proclaiming his loyalty to his queen or something, I think. <laughs> what? Okay. I was like, why did my. Oh, one of you tried to do something. I have no idea what's going on, by the way. <laughs> Like, what the frick is happening? Yeah, I got 30 ink. I should have brought that apocalypse fire. Okay. I think what I want to do... Don't. Please don't. Don't. For frick's sakes, I knew he was going to do that. Because what I wanted to do was... Get the frick out of there. Frick! Like, I wanted to move myself to this spot. So I can get closer to the apocalypse fight so I can push him in. But it's just not working out in my favor, is it? Okay. You know what? We're going to do this. I am going to... Why can I not summon any more Inculinatis? Oh, I'm sleeping. Sleep. Yeah, attack this guy. Two HP, that's fine. And then you can get a hit on him. But he sleep and then you can look at us over here and kill this guy or we'll stop just stop him from coming into my range actually that's fine I should have done that ages ago why didn't I do that I don't know
Yo, I prolonged this battle way more than it should have been. I should have been cooking them. Okay. Push. Yes. Ma And then go over. Uh, you attack this guy. It's gonna kill him. So that's fine. That was terrible. That was not good. Just take everything. I need all the help I can get. Your health regeneration a uh, little after every battle and by how many points you may attack like it's at the beginning that depends on your difficulty well yeah no sh <laughs> every time they draw a beast their bottom look you know that would have been nice to you to tell me before i went into battle the more in cast to draw a beast now repeat Just always <laughs> they're never bored. Repeat. <laughs> As you decrease boredom, draw different beasts in your next battle. Fire beast versus beast battle. Chapel. Yes. Okay. Okay. I really wish I can, you know what? I should have, I should have brought the other units. The, the guy that cost 22, that would have been nice. Hmm. Shut up. Okay. What the frig is this? Where is my Inkulinai? Uh, <laughs> no idea. Oh, so I I don't have any including I just have my oh this is a defensive battle I think by the look of it. Move over here. That is unfortunate. Well, so you can play that game if you're being honest. How much damage can I do? Two to three? Okay, I'm gonna need to disable this guy's accuracy real quick. <laughs> But how will it attack up um, two fields away deals additional damage to heretic one two five heal full five <clears throat> okay why are you mm. You're about to get on my nerves. Okay, he's not close enough. He's about to die. Can you heal him? I don't think it's... I don't think it's gonna... I don't think it's gonna help, but... Um... What do I wanna do? Holy pause. I can't even reach him. Yo, I hate this game. I just healed. <laughs> I freaking hate this game. Ouch. Okay, well that 
is not good. All right, I'm gonna stay my ass over here. Why is this guy still not appreciating all the efforts I'm putting in? Why is he still bored? <clears throat> hmm. Chapter two, okay. Hell the birds. Yo, I'm getting cooked by these archers. Should have done this in the first place. And I'm dead. Yeah. Alright, you know what? <laughs> Screw this game. I don't care no more. I quit. Alright. <laughs> Look at this.